How is it going guys? So today I'm going to be talking about weapon customization and weapons in general in Just Cause 3 because I have so many awesome ideas that I wanted to share with you guys and I thought it would be pretty cool just to share my ideas and of course it does build up hype for the game as well. So if you guys like the sound of anything that I mentioned in the video or just overall in general enjoy the video, please do smack that like button down below and who knows maybe if a developer see this video and hear something that isn't exactly in the game at this moment in time but like the idea, who knows like I said they might possibly add it so make sure you guys just smack that like button and now without further ado let's continue right into today's just cause free video so at this moment in time we haven't exactly seen a huge amount of weapons within this game but within the screenshots we have seen some pretty awesome weapons such as the bazooka the pistol the ak-47 and one of my favorites the minigun which is absolutely insane but at this moment in time we haven't unfortunately seen any of them in action but I do believe we will actually later this month but I guess we can only wait and see. Now although these guns do look so awesome considering we haven't seen them in action yet we don't exactly know how they are going to turn out. For example the minigun for instance is it actually going to affect Rico our main character when he's using it in terms of running or is there going to be no realism at all and he's just going to sprint with a minigun. I guess we can only wait and see but as I mentioned a few seconds ago without a doubt these weapons look absolutely insane. Now one thing that I really want them to add in Just Cause 3 is a bigger range in shotguns because back in Just Cause 3 there weren't exactly as many shotguns as I thought there would be. So something that I really want to see in Just Cause 3 is a double barrel gun for example or just your ordinary shotgun but even way shotguns in general do cause a lot of damage. And if they went ahead and added automatic shotguns, that would literally just be a dream come true. Just imagine how much chaos you can do with that gun. Now besides those guns, I have two specific snipers that I would love to see make an appearance in this game because without a doubt, this is going to be a really stealthy game. But then again, I guess it does kind of give you that option to either be stupid or smart. Like you can either go in guns firing or be super smart in this sort of case, use snipers and all that good stuff. And personally, I am probably going to do that the first time round and then the second time I'm just going to take all the stupid moves but the two specific snipers I want to see is the Barrack 50 Cal and the Dragonov. Now I know although they probably won't look as awesome in third person compared to first person they still are pretty effective and it will be a great gun to have in this game. Now besides that I just want to see the most common submachine guns such as the MP5s and all that good stuff and with that said that does actually bring me on to the next topic that I wanted to talk about in this video which of course is weapon customization because this is something definitely needed in Just Cause 3. Now back in Just Cause 2 when you did run out of ammo it was pretty easy to get all you had to do was run around and hope you found a box with the same ammo or you just had to go find another gun either dropped from an enemy or just laying around so it was pretty easy and I would imagine it will be the same in Just Cause 3 but this time I want us the players and the guns to actually have some sort of meaning if that makes any sense like where you can just customize it to the max so you feel you've spent a lot on that gun and that the gun is actually super powerful and effective. And there is of course going to be a black market as well so this will all tie into one. Now with weapon customization I don't really want anything unrealistic or something pretty insane like an all gold gun although that would be pretty cool I highly doubt they will add that but in terms of weapon customization to me I just mean adding silencers to gun, extra mags, maybe a red dot and some sort of camo as well although like I said a few seconds ago I highly doubt we will get all gold or something like that but even if there isn't any camo I'm really happy with a silencer, a red dot and extra mags because those are the most important ones to me. And dual wielding as well is something that I assume would happen again in Just Cause 3 considering it did back in Just Cause 2 but this time just imagine how much more fun it would be but where we have the option to customize our weapons. And lastly one more thing that I really want to see is night vision goggles and again it's pretty basic but really effective. So Avalanche Studios if you are watching this and haven't added anything that I've mentioned in the video please do do it because it's something that we all want and it will change the game in a good way so please Avalanche Studios add any of these ideas if you haven't already. But guys, with that said, that does unfortunately bring today's video to an end. Don't forget to thumbs it up if you enjoyed it or like the sound of any things that I mentioned in the video. But as always, it's really appreciated and it really does motivate me even more to produce content for you guys. And as well, if you guys are new around here, then please do go ahead and hit that big red button down below if you would like to stay updated with more open world game news such as Just Cause 3, Tom Clancy's The Division and a ton more. That'd be absolutely amazing and I'll love you forever. 
And with that said, I'll hopefully catch you guys in the next video, but until then, as always, I hope you're having yourselves a super awesome day, and stay awesome, stay beautiful, and adios amigos.